I felt like we were in good hands. I felt like Sasha understood what we wanted and that he did everything in his power. He was well educated on his business. It wasn't a side job for him and he gave us his time. And we weren't, we weren't, we're not, we're not a multi-million dollar couple either. So I felt that he didn't look at that as, as a factor. He looked at us as just one of his regular clients and he gave us all of the attention, um, attention that he would give all of his clients. We didn't feel pressure from Sasha to buy the house, to sell our house. He always he gave, gave us, us the information. facts. That's right. He gave us information. He gave us the facts to do with what we needed to do yeah. with, and that was it. Yeah. On both ends, yeah. he didn't he didn't hide anything. He just told you what was what, and then you made your decision. No pressure. And when we asked when we asked his opinion as yes. as a real estate person, he would give it to us. Uh, but not until that point did he really influence. want to try and, and he didn't it was clear he didn't want to try and influence us he wanted us to be uh, managing the process right mm -hmm. sasha was really good at um, the paper process um, i'd like to add too that his team that he works with um, is also very good so if sasha wasn't available someone always was available to answer your questions um, or to get paperwork done especially yeah. his wife um, Louisa. Louisa was she's she's incredible. She always makes sure that you understand what you're signing and you make sure that you're very comfortable with what you're signing before you go ahead and put your signature down on yeah. the paper.